Trey Paxton from GamingShogun.com at the 2008 CES here in Las Vegas, Nevada. We're here at the Microsoft booth here, and uh, we're at their Games for Windows display. So we're looking at Age of Conan right now. I've seen a few things on the beta. It looks like it's going to be a really solid game. Good MMO. It's actually going down. Oh. Yeah, those guys don't want any. They're all hurt. Jared, could you tell us a little bit about Age of Conan? Yeah, sure. Uh, Age of Conan is a new upcoming MMO that we're releasing. Uh, it's from Funcom. It's a mature-rated MMO. So it's one of the first M-rated games that will be out there for MMOers. Uh, things like blood spatter, sexual themes, decapitation. So it's right. it's more for the adult players. Uh, some unique things about the game, of course, it is an online role-playing game. So you have the aspect of actually developing your character through uh, leveling and through experiences and talent points. But we also have the ability for you to do uh, huge raids or PvP. Uh, mounted combat, that's a cool feature you haven't seen in other games. Instead of just using a horse for transportation, you actually can use it to mow down your enemies and also use it as siege weapons. Siege weapons come in handy because they're also, at the end game, uh, guilds can actually build up their own battle keeps. And other guilds can come along and try to take them over. Oh, that's great. So you can actually use them uh, for offensive structures to take down buildings, as well as like trebuchets and other items you can use. Uh, the game has very intense graphics. It's scalable though, anything from DX9 all the way up to DX10 uh, from XP or Vista. So if you have like a dual core XP machine all the way up to a quad core, you know, Vista machine, you'll be able to set the video settings according to how you want to play. Oh, that's great. Any plans to support any of the DirectX 10.1 feature set at all? Uh, I'm not sure what the feature set is, but we have DX10 capability and we have a build for that already. Oh, that's great. Um, whenever you get a moment, would you mind showing us a little bit of uh, playing of the game? Yeah, sure, sure. What we have here is this is a Dark Templar. Uh, he's kind of a mix between a Dark Mage and a uh, Warrior type class. So he has some spell casting abilities. Right. He can sacrifice himself to actually heal others, and he has uh, a lot of tanking abilities as well. Uh, the combat system is different than other MMOs that you've seen. Instead of it being like a, a point, click, and then automatic attack, I actually have to go and fight, kind of like a first-person shooter type feel. So what I do is I actually enter into combat mode, and then I find someone that I want to attack. And I have, since I'm only 25 right now, I only have three attacks that I can do as okay. base attacks. One being a left attack, three being a right attack, and two being a center attack. Oh. Now, I can use those different attacks based upon what my opponent has. As you see, there's visual indicators here letting me know that he's got some uh, a shield on those sides of uh, his body. So I don't want to attack him on those sides. Very cool. If I keep on hacking away at his head, eventually he's going to move all those shields to his head. So the NPCs will actually learn to start blocking if you do like one attack over and over again. That's great. The other cool thing, like see you just did it there. The other cool thing you can do is also the combos. When you activate a combo, it'll highlight on the screen which combination you're supposed to do. So if I hit two, then I'll do my spin move or my stab. And those combinations will actually allow me to do things like fatalities. I'll try to show you one of those real quick. Fatalities are basically when you finish off your opponent with a combo, you have a chance to do cool things like chop his head off oh, or great. stab him in his gut and nice. punch him over. So <laughs> there's all sorts of different ways you can creatively finish off your opponents in the game. And uh, the PvP in the game is going to be extremely fun too because, as you can tell, I have to move around and fight my enemies. Right. So when you've got a whole bunch of guys running around trying to fight each other, you know, there's going to be a lot of movement, a lot of activity. You're not going to see guys who are like facing this way and somehow hitting you way over there. You know, you have, you have to be next to each other, hitting each other, and up, up against each other. Uh, there is there is a uh, magic in the game too. We do have some classes like a demonologist, which is a mix between a mage and a pet class. Uh, he's got a sucky with him or something that come to fight for him. Uh, there's also a uh, priest as well. Uh, you can have like a bear shop, which is a mix between a melee and a casting class that can heal. Uh, the other neat thing too is the heals in the game aren't just like. Some other MMOs, if you're a healer class and you're a raid, you basically you keep pushing your heal button. You just kind of yeah. stay there. It doesn't matter where your group is, as long as they're in range of the heal, they're going to get healed. Well, in our game, you actually have to come up and there'll be like a focus target cone in front of you where if I'm healing you, I'll hit you and the guy behind you. And uh, that way I actually can find you, run over to you, and then I'll throw a hot on you. So that way you're getting healed over time. Okay. And I can run off and do my own, own fire. So I'm not just exclusively locked in. Right. You can do multiple things. More right. And uh, are we still on? Uh, 
Yes, uh, what I've been told is March 25th this year. That's a pretty solid day right now. Great. Thank you very much, Jerry. I really no appreciate problem. it. Glad you guys are talking about Product not yet rated. Let me tell you of my days of glory. I was young then, and strong. My sword was the only thing I could trust. Above all, Conan. Monarch by grit, determination, and steel. He made us build a kingdom to rule and ravage. Stone by stone, nation by nation. But it was all destroyed in a heartbeat. As we fought for our future, we crossed all of Hyboria. We saw the unspeakable horrors. We saw its amazing treasures. We saw splendors undreamed of. We lived its temptations. We fought like demons against the darkest creatures of the earth. scars, but I would walk no other path. 